Hello, Assalamu alaikum dear students. I welcome you all in my next lesson. So now here it's time to start. Okay, this is my lecture number four of unit number two. As you already know that we have started unit number two, the tale of custard, the dragon, it's a poem. And we have done stanza number one, two, three, four and five. And now it's time to do the stanza number six and stanza number seven. So here we go. Suddenly, suddenly, they heard a nasty sound and Master growled and they all looked around. Meowch cried Ink and Ouch cried Belinda for there was a pirate climbing in the window. Okay, I repeat. Suddenly, suddenly, they heard a nasty sound and Master growled and they all looked around. Meowch cried Ink and Oh! cried Belinda, for there was a pirate climbing in the window. Okay, here, dear students, what happens while in stanza number 5, you know that they all were going in the red wagon. All the animals were sitting in the red wagon, which was being taken by Belinda. Now, what happens that suddenly they saw a nasty sound. Nasty sound mean, means that a very unpleasant sound, a very bad sound. They heard a very bad sound. Who heard? All these animals and Belinda. And mustard growled and they all looked around. Now the mustard made, made a sound like he made a roaring sound. Like he was roaring. He made a roaring sound, roaring sound and they were looking all around, right? Okay, then Meowch cried ink. Ink called, uh, made a sound. Ink made a sound of meow and plus ouch. Like meow and ouch sound was mixed which becomes meowch, right? And oh cried Belinda. And what did Belinda do? She said oh. She said she cried oh. For there was a pirate. Climbing in the window. Now, for there was a pirate. Pirate means a sea robber. Who is pirate? A sea robber. A person who robbers in the sea. Right? Okay. Climbing in the window. Now, here the word window means window. Means window. Now, here the poet uh, has made a rhythmic sound for Belinda, so he uh, wrote the word Vinda for window, just to make a rhythm, right? Okay, now there was a pirate who was climbing up the window, who was climbing up the window. Now here in this stanza, what we studied, we saw that suddenly the all animals along with the Belinda, they heard a very bad sound, a very strange noise they heard. And here the mustard, he was roaring and they all were looking all around. And the cat, the ink, she made a sound like meowch. And Belinda said, oh, and what they saw? They saw a pirate, a sea robber who was climbing up the window. Okay, it was all about the stanza number six. Now let's see what does happen next in stanza number seven. Pistol in his left hand, pistol in his right. And he held in his teeth a cutlass bright. His beard was black, one leg was wood. It was clear that the pirate meant no good. I repeat, pistol in his left hand, pistol in his right. And he held in his teeth a cutlass bright. His beard was black, one leg was wood. It was clear that the pirate meant no good. Okay, now here in this stanza, they, there is uh, a description of a pirate. Now here in this stanza, uh, there is a description of a pirate that what does he look like? He was having a pistol in his both hands. He was having pistols in his both hands. And he heard in his teeth a cut less bright. Now, what does it mean? A cut less bright. Like he was having a short uh, kind of a short sword he was having with us with which was having a curve sharp knife, right? And one side it was a sword, and on the other side it was having sharp curve knife, right? 
अच्छा देन हिज बियर्ड वॉज ब्लैक एंड ही वॉज ऑल्सो बियर्ड मीन्स ही वॉज हैविंग अ बियर राइट एंड ही वॉज हैविंग वन आर्टिफिशियल लैग लाइक ही वॉज हैविंग वन लैग नॉर्मल एंड द अदर लैग वॉज वॉज वेरी आर्टिफिशियल एंड वॉज मेड ऑफ वर्ड एंड इट वॉज क्लियर दैट द पायरेट मैंट नो गुड एंड इट वॉज वेरी मच क्लियर दैट ही इज गोइंग टू हार्म दैम ही इज गोइंग टू ड्रॉप the pirate is going to rob and is going to harm the animals and belinda so dear students it was all about the stanza number 6 and stanza number 7 now you all have to learn all these stanzas dear students remember as this is my fourth video so the reason of making short video for this uh, for this poem is that you should learn this poem so that you can learn this poem easily like here in stanza number 1 just four or five lines in stanza number 2 just a few lines so that you can learn them easily right so learn stanza number 6 and 7 okay so inshallah we will meet in the next video till then take care of yourself stay happy stay blessed and stay safe